Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the Easter eggs in Miley Cyrus's Flowers. For this list, we'll be looking at the nods, references, and hints that the singer may have sprinkled throughout her latest hit Flowers and its music video. Did you spot any other Easter eggs? Let us know in the comments. Number 6. Calling back to their couple's Pilates days Throughout their relationship, countless articles and photos informed the world that Miley and then-partner Liam Hemsworth attended Pilates classes together. In the music video, Cyrus can be seen exercising on her patio in what some believe could be a nod to the couple's joint workout days. Talk to myself for hours, yeah, say things you don't. Miley goes hard, giving herself a full-body workout as she sings about self-love and self-care, a running theme throughout the song. Who's to say if this is a callback to her past relationship, or maybe she's just super into fitness? One thing's for sure, whether she's in a relationship or flying solo, it's Miley who wears the yoga pants. Well, metaphorically. Number 5. A Lyrical Deep Dive Into the Theme of Self-Love Underneath this positive, upbeat empowerment anthem possibly lies some veiled jabs about Miley's ex-husband. She previously shared that there was, quote, too much conflict in the relationship, and the repeated I can love me better lyric perhaps nods to some of that marital tension. She also reiterates that she didn't choose to end the relationship, possibly hinting at reports that she wanted to work on the marriage, and Hemsworth was the one who filed for divorce. I didn't want to leave you, I didn't want to fight, started to cry but then remembered I. Moreover, in the second verse, she sings, Paint my nails, cherry red, match the roses that you lay. Maybe giving us some insight into a private moment between the two following their split. Still, she states she's ready to forgive and move on before happy dancing around her home. Number 4. Red Carpet Throwbacks Look at y'all! Hello! Hey, you're running away. Okay. He's running away. Hello? Get over here, hubs! How are we doing? Okay, From their stunning attire to their playful antics, this former couple made some colorful red carpet appearances. Remember when Hemsworth told his partner to behave after she jokingly pretended to lick him at the Avengers Endgame premiere? How about the time Cyrus seemingly embarrassed her beau while demonstrating their couple's dance move during an interview? What does a dance number look like between the two of you? Like this. Ah, uh, uh, What? <laughs> right. the oh, you're not for the twerk? Yeah. Fans believe they noticed callbacks to these headline-worthy moments in the Flowers music video. You'll have to keep your eyes peeled to spot it, but there's a moment where she dances in a similar fashion as she did on the red carpet. Say things you don't understand. Also, some think her oversized suit resembles Hemsworth's outfit at the Endgame premiere. Number 3. Connections to Bruno Mars's When I Was Your Man If when you first heard Miley Cyrus's Flowers, you thought something about it sounded familiar, you weren't alone. According to an unconfirmed rumor, Liam once dedicated Bruno Mars's When I Was Your Man to her sometime after their engagement in 2013. I should have bought you flowers the singer flips the narrative by declaring that everything Mars claims he should have done for his lover, she could do for herself better. Indeed, when you listen to the lyrics side by side, it's a pretty compelling theory. Take you to everybody, cause all you wanted to do was dance. I can take myself dancing. There's even a subtle likeness in the melody. Some also thought they heard samples of Gloria Gaynor's I Will Survive in the tune, which would make sense given both tracks' shared theme. Now I'm saving all my loving for someone who's loving me. Number 2. The Woolsey Fire That Burned Down Their Home The opening lyrics describe a picture-perfect relationship. We were good, we were cold, kind of dream that can't be sold. 
Miley previously told Rolling Stone that it looked like she was living a fairy tale life with Liam. However, she then goes on to sing about a home that she and her partner watched burn down. We were right till we weren't built a home and watched it burn. Sure, this could be interpreted as a metaphor for the relationship. But if you recall, Miley and Liam's Malibu home was among the thousands destroyed by the 2018 Woolsey Fire that ravaged Los Angeles and Ventura counties in California. Your Burned house down. was destroyed, right? Yeah. And you have, like, a, a menagerie of animals. Both shared stories about how the Hunger Games actor saved all her animals and a few other possessions. He was so incredible, he got all the animals out in his truck. He put two pigs in crates, which I tell you is so hard. Miley has even stated that his rescue mission, in part, gave them that final push to walk down the aisle. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. The song was released on Liam Hemsworth's 33rd birthday. Now, we think you'd agree that these speculative Easter eggs are almost too convincing to be coincidental. Can take myself and, I can hold my own head. and packaged together, it seems inevitable that this song is about her ex-husband. But if you still need a little nudge, let's look at the date the song premiered. Midnight, January 13th. What a coincidence. That just happens to be Liam Hemsworth's birthday. What are the odds? Then remembered I, I can buy myself flowers. Uh -huh. And what better way to say happy 33rd birthday to your ex than letting the world know that you're better off without him? Isn't that just the icing and cherry on the cake, as well as the perfectly knotted bow on top of the birthday present? with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from Ms. Mojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.